Today's topic is Worried about bad food habits at work? Here are five steps to get back on track. Do you feel like you're letting yourself down and compromising your health goals with your workplace eating habits? A survey found that 65% of adult workers are overweight or obese, which is understandable since adults spend 8.8 .8 hours a day working or performing work-related activities. The sheer amount of time and effort spent working can make it difficult to correct your habits, but it is important to keep trying. If you are looking to keep your health goals intact and do not want your work to interfere with them, here are five steps you should follow. Replace your source of sugars. The first step you must take is to replace your sugar source. Completely cutting down on sugars while you are working could be difficult because you need the energy to get through the day. However, a simpler way of making your snacking habit healthy is to replace candy or sweet bowl with a fruit bowl. Just moving the candy bowl away can reduce your dependency on sugars, while the fruit bowl can promote healthy eating habits. Bring healthy snacks from food. Another way of avoiding a workplace binge is to plan and bring your healthy snacks from home. Go for nuts, granola bars, or dried fruits if you keep your snacks in your desk drawer. If you have access to a refrigerator, yogurt, fresh fruit, or raw vegetables are what you can go for. Avoid the vending machine. All the snacks that you might like from your vending machine are probably full of salt, sugars, and calories. At the same time, these snacks are low in nutritional value and can only negatively affect your health. It's better to eat something fresh rather than anything from the vending machine. Keep yourself hydrated. Not getting the right amount of water during the day can increase anxiety and fatigue while also affecting memory. This decreases your performance, making it imperative to keep yourself hydrated during a workday. Drinking water also helps keep you full, decreasing your appetite and stopping you from snacking. Drinking water instead of soda saves you from hundreds of calories. Don't eat alone at your desk. Eating alone will increase the amount of food you eat during lunch. Rather than eating alone at your desk, it's better to eat with coworkers. It will also help restrict the amount you eat, but also help increase cooperative behavior and work performance. Going on a walk during lunchtime can also help eat smaller meals. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.